This is Swayak June 2023 General Mathematics Paper 2 and we are answering question number 4. And the question reads, in the diagram PQ, R and S are points on the cycle. And that cycle has a center at the case. You can see the points P, Q, R and S, they are points on the cycle. And that cycle has a center at the point K. And uh, the line KR, line KR is a bisector of the angle SRQ. Line KR, look at the line KR. So this line serves a bisector of angle, angle SRQ, this very angle. And you have also in the question angle KSP as 41 degrees, it is also marked in the drawing. And angle SKR as 80, it is also marked in the drawing. The question asks is to find uh, the angle RQP, that is Roman 1, and uh, the angle SPQ. The question is interested in finding the size of those two, two angles. Solution to the problem. So starting with the angle RQP, RQP, it is this angle that I wanted to find first. Probably I cannot get to this angle until I find some other angles. Let me just check if I can find this angle, this angle KSROSK, this very angle. I will add it with this angle 41. And to get out this angle 41, if whatever I have here, this angle is opposite to this angle at Q because RQPS is a circular collateral. And I have a theorem which says opposite angles of a circular collateral are supplementary. So let me just think how I can get this angle. This triangle, look at the triangle. Look at this very triangle. This is an isosceles triangle because K to R is radius, K to S is another radius, and radii are equal. If that is correct, then this angle and this will now be base angle of the isosceles triangle. Then, which means I can find this because this angle is. None. So sum of angles in an isosceles triangle will now be, if I subtract this angle from sum and divide the result by 2, it will give me the size of the base angles. So this angle RSK will now be 180 minus 80 divided by 2. And my reason it is sum of angles in an isosceles triangle. If the subtraction is done correctly and division, you now have that angle as 50 degrees. So this angle will now be 50. So I can now find the angle RSP, the whole of this very angle. Let me do that. So angle RSP would now be 50 plus 41. And that gives a result to 91 degrees. So this angle, 91 degrees, together with the angle at Q, that is angle RQP. The opposite angles of a cyclic collateral and the addition of the two angles gives 180. So I can now write uh, angle RQP to be cos 180 minus 91. 91, this very 91, which, which is this. And my reason is the opposite angles of a cyclic collateral. Subtracting 91 from 180 correctly gives result 89. So this angle will now be 89. So question Roman 1 has been answered. So I move to question Roman 2. Question Roman 2, we are interested in finding the size of angle SPQ. SPQ, this very angle. This very angle. Similarly, if I can find this, if I can find this, I'm done also. I can use the same concept, opposite angles of a cyclic collateral, with this to find the angle SPQ. Already this is 50. Because it is a base angle with this, let me just write it. So angle SRK, SRK, this is now going to be 50. This will be 50 base angle together with this. And remember this line KR is stated in the question. Line KR is a bisector of angle SRQ. So the whole of this angle, this is now a bisector. Bisector means the line that divides the angle into two equal halves. So if this is 50, this also is going to be 50. Let me just write it. So angle SRQ, SRQ is now going to be 100 because this is 50. This will also be 50, half of 100. So this will now be 100. The entire of this angle will be 100 degrees. Angle SRQ. So which means I can now compare this and this as opposite angles of a cyclic collateral. 
to find the size of that angle SPQ to be 180 minus 100, this very angle, and my reason is the opposite angles of a cyclic collateral. And subtracting 100 from 180 gives you this very 80 degrees as the size of this angle. So this Roman 2 question has also been answered. So let me just share with you quickly how this question is now marked. During the market of this June 2023 YK paper 2, so the very first mark is the method one mark, and this method one mark is forgetting, is forgetting the angle S, R, S, K, that is subtracting 80 from 180 and dividing the result by 2. You have this method one mark. And when you have that angle correctly as 50 degrees, you have this accuracy one mark. The next mark is attempting to get the angle at Q using opposite angles of a cyclic collateral or any other valid theorem. You have this method one mark. And when that is now done correctly and you have the angle as 89 degrees exactly, you have this accuracy one mark. So Roman 1 has four good marks. Moving to Roman 2 question, you have bonus one mark. For getting the angle SRK, SRK, this very angle as 50 degrees because it is base angle together with this. So that gives you bonus one mark. The next mark is for getting the entire angle SRQ as 100 degrees. You have bonus one mark. And the next mark is for attempting to get that very angle at P using opposite angles of a cyclic collateral or any other valid theorem that gives you method one mark and uh, when that is now done correctly and you have your answer as 80 degrees you have this accuracy one mark so roman two person also has uh, four good marks